What's up everyone and welcome back to yet another video. My name is Lucas and I am the founder of Ergogenic Health. And in today's video, I am really excited to be presenting some pretty novel findings on a very, very well-known uh, antidepressant herb that's gaining a lot of popularity in the nootropic space. So what I'm going to do in this video is present to you a very cool finding um, that basically looks at how St. John's wort, also known as Hypericum perforatum, uh, how this particular herb can influence our perception of the world and, and, and specifically focusing on uh, our ability to interpret both positive and negative cues. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share my screen and show you exactly which study uh, piqued my interest. Um, so you can see here, subchronic treatment with St. John's wort produces a positive shift in emotional processing in healthy volunteers. Now, essentially what this study found was that short-term treatment, and this was only after six days of treatment in healthy volunteers, that after six days, they then subjected them to a um, particular test or actually a couple of tests where they wanted to analyze uh, the patient's response to um, various facial expressions. So what they found was that St. John's wort produced changes in emotional processing similar to those found with other antidepressants. And what they noted was that St. John's wort decreased the perception of disgusted facial expressions. It increased memory recall for positive stimuli. And it also reduced attentional vigilance to unmasked face, uh, fearful faces. So basically what that's doing is that it's St. John's wort is altering our perception and it's shifting our focus towards more positive um, stimuli and blocking out negative stimuli, which I find very fascinating and very applicable to those that are suffering from um, fear-based um, depression. Now, obviously, guys, you know that this, all of my content is not medical advice. I'm simply presenting research. Um, so... I'll scroll down so you can have a look there. Uh, and what else? So I also have noted that um, the heightened attention to threat related information is actually associated with depression and anxiety. And you'll often see this reduced by antidepressant treatment. Uh, they noted that St. John's wort also reduced recognition of disgusted facial expressions and Funnily enough, they actually also reported that the pro-inflammatory agent interferon alpha also caused depression and increased the disgust of recognition in patients undergoing treatment for hepatitis. So what that means is that here's another link of how inflammation can actually drive up um, depressive-like behavior and even influence our um, emotional response to various stimuli. So... I found this study very fascinating. If you guys like this video, please do share it around. I will be releasing a lot more nootropic related content in the next few months. Um, and also I highly encourage you to check out the links in the video description. I have a website with, with hundreds of amazing resources, really useful health products. I've got a nootropics course, which you guys have to join. It's a free course on how you can hack your brain. Um, otherwise, thank you for tuning in and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.